Hi everybody, 2019 on the YouTube channel. I'm still excited about the new year. I hope you've been enjoying all of our content. I wanted to introduce some of the latest and greatest job trends of 2019 because there are so many. So I was trying to think about this, do a little bit of research. Here are what I would say the top job trends of 2019 are. Number one, it's all about self-care, which is kind of ironic, right? Because we're talking about the workplace, but self-care is the hottest topic right now. It's what everybody's talking about. Turn on the news, open a magazine, read a blog. All you're gonna see is a bunch of content on self-care and how people are prioritizing self-care over work, really. And so I think the trend for 2019 is that employers are gonna really have to start valuing self-care for their teams and work together with their team members because that's what the people want, folks. <laughs> kind of in line with self-care and, and just sort of disconnection is the second job trend. And that is that you don't have to get back to every single email. I think we all used to think that you had to answer emails. It was almost an email competition. Who can answer the most emails? emails, who can respond the fastest, fastest, can't talk today. But now people are saying, you know what? You're one person, you're human, your inbox is becoming what a mailbox used to be, right? It's filled with a bunch of junk, right? And a bunch of stuff from strangers, a bunch of mailers. So respond to what you can respond to. And if you don't get back to everybody, don't feel bad about it. You know what you need to do, you know who you need to respond to, and everyone else is just gonna have to wait because you're one person and you gotta do you, right? Another trend is the more creative, the better when it comes to resumes. We are seeing resumes designed using programs like Canva. No, Canva is not sponsoring this video should, <laughs> um, but just creative, uh, creative templates for resumes are really everywhere and they really give you an opportunity to get your resume to the top of the pile because it's just gonna look a little bit different than everybody else's, right? As I always say, you don't wanna go cuckoo with it, but add in a graphic or two, give it some design and give it some sort of cool format because when you're looking at a pile of resumes, boring, 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 it's really great to see a creatively formatted resume. Prior to this year, you wouldn't have really heard too much about that. I wouldn't be encouraging everyone to do it, but I think regardless of industry, formatting your resume in a creative, fun way is definitely a, a must do for 2019. Another trend is, I'm gonna call this slipping into the DMs, right? It's crazy how people are connecting with each other and building relationships on Instagram. Is it the most professional? Wah! But it's working and it's happening. So follow your companies, follow the CEOs of companies if they have a public Instagram profile and you never know what you're gonna find on there. I say this all the time. I constantly see my favorite bloggers on Instagram posting about needing a video intern or hiring for their first assistant or whatever it might be. So don't be afraid of slipping into those DMs. You can still keep it professional. You don't need to be weird about it. You don't need to write sup, right? But you can professionally introduce yourself and tell someone what you're looking for on Instagram. That's just how it's going these days. Last but certainly not least, we're continuing to see this trend of flexibility. I know we're really embracing it in 2019 at Intern Queen at my company, but just this sort of like, you can be productive from anywhere. And it's not necessarily about the length of time you put in or where you're sitting and doing the work. It's this get your work done, be an adult. Um, a lot of companies are embracing the unlimited vacation policy because they don't care how or where it gets done. They just want it done, right? And if you can get your work done and then go on vacation, cool, go on vacation. So I think this sort of, you know, take ownership of your work, be an adult, work from anywhere, get it done. It's definitely happening. We need to be careful with how it happens, right? Cause you don't want it to get too chaotic, but this work from anywhere is definitely a thing, you know, now, more so than ever before. So that is your 2019 trend report. I'm Lauren Berger reporting live.